Hello everybody and welcome back to Advanced Maths. Today we're looking at regression lines and we're going to be calculating these using the graphical calculator. So a regression line is basically a line of best fit for your scatter graph. And when you have a scatter graph, you've got two different choices for your regression line. You've got the y on x regression line, which is given by y equals ax plus b. And this is used to estimate the y value when you are given the x value. Alternatively, you can have the x on y regression line. And this is given by x equals cy plus d. And that is used to estimate the x value given the y value. Okay, So it depends on the context of the question, which one you're going to use. Let's look at this in action. So here we have an example. An ice cream shop wants to know if the weather affected their sales. So they collected data on the number of sales and the outside temperature. And this is displayed in the table below. So we've got the table there with the temperature and the sales. Uh, now we are going to find uh, the y on x regression line and the x on y regression line for the equation. Uh, we're going to predict the number of sales when the temperature is 27 degrees and we're going to predict the temperature uh, when needed for 70 sales. And then it asks us to comment on the accuracy of this prediction. Okay, now the independent variable here is the temperature. Uh, whereas the dependent variable, which we are measuring, is the number of sales. Uh, so the independent variable, the temperature, is the x value, and the number of sales is the y value. Okay. So we're going to go to our graphing calculator, and we're going to go to statistics, and we're going to enter the data from our table into the calculator. You press E, X, E every time to move to the next row, sorry, column, and enter it for the temperature. Now you're going to go to the next column by pressing your right and enter the uh, data for the next uh, column in there. Okay, we just enter all our data. Then we go to settings. I'm going to check that we've set it like this, where the X list is list one and the Y list is X two. Press exit, I go to regression, X, and we're going to go to AX plus B here. And this gives us our values of regression, where A is the gradient 1.54 and B is minus 13.86. And we put that into our Y equals MX plus C or Y equals AX plus B um, equation. And that's it. That's how you find the regression line there. Now to find the X and Y regression line, we're just going to go backwards and change our settings from before. We're going to change our uh, lists to X list being list 2 and our Y list being list 1. And we change that, we go back into regression now and it changes our regression line to have a different A value and a different B value. And this is what we get. We get X equals 0.581Y plus 10.305 uh, on the end. Okay, so we found our two regression lines there. Now let's move on. We can now find the um, number of sales when the temperature is 27 degrees. Okay, so the temperature is the x value. I'm going to put that into the equation like this. Substitute in 27, type this into our calculator, and we get y is 27.7, or we can just call that about 28 sales, because sales are measured in whole numbers. Now, predict the temperature needed for 70 sales. Okay, so this is going the other way. I'm going to use the other regression line here, where the y value is 70, substitute 70 in, and we we'll tap into the calculator, we get 50.98 degrees, which is a extremely high temperature uh, here. Uh, so it's unlikely that our normal behavior will continue, and therefore, I imagine the linear relationship will not uh, continue at those high temperatures. Okay, that's everything for today's video. We have answered all of the questions. Uh, and I hope you now know how to find a regression line from an equation. Thank you for watching. Remember to like and subscribe so you don't miss any future videos. And if you want any uh, support with IB Maths, uh, you can check out advancedmaths.com. We've got plenty more resources available for your revision.
all of it completely free and free to everyone. Thanks for watching and good luck in your exams.